People are not sheeps, and we are not the shepherd dog. As leaders, we need to avoid certain cliches while we work with our teams. Today, we will be looking for this dangerous words to be used. People rather have a preference to follow a natural leader or a business guru so that they also learn how to lead themselves and others in any given environment or basically do not give a value. In my past experience, there is no midway in between. Therefore, people in leadership roles have a tremendous responsibility to speak facts and realities, not just bullshit around the topics. Most of the time, leaders have no more chance than two times to be assuring the team members on a topic. Leaders must think through in advance and consider with care the meaning of each word they prefer to use. There is always a way to say things and imply things by using specific words versus another's. To be truthful to themselves as well as to others who fall under their responsibility, leaders should avoid the following five common statements. 1. We are a family. Families are a bunch of people who praise and keep loving people no matter what. In families, there is always a place for the ones who fails repetitively. Parents do not fire their children when they don't efficiently clean the kitchen table. Business is business. Also, family rhetoric is something which doesn't attract the whole of the team you are talking to. Some people prefer to be a part of a belonging. Some are lonely wolves. 2. We are fully transparent. It is impossible to manage a business being 100% transparent. Transparency on decision-making, teamwork is important. However, while we work on using keywords like fully, totally, no matter what, we should be careful. If you are CEO of a company, the board might be willing you to increase the sales of a specific unit of the business, and at the same time, you might be needing to sell this business to another company. People who you are working with should know, in case you tell something, you are behind it. 3. I am amazed with the upcoming journey. Let's be honest. No one is amazed, fascinated, thrilled with new coming thing. This is only a phrase which we see every day in link to decrease fear of being unsuccessful from a future step. Every new coming topic is arriving with too many question marks, giving the guarantee to the people that they will not be alone in the upcoming journey might be more satisfying for the people than seeing how much you are happy in advance. Don't be the stewards smiling at the gate of the plane. It is okay to be non-smiling pilot who will bring us home safely. 4. Let's not forget to have some fun. Having fun at work is a great thing, however, most of the professionals are not getting up 6 o'clock in the morning to have fun during the day. Business isn't supposed to be boring, we all agree, but people who focus to work shouldn't be obliged. Boring gathering activities. There is certain amount of people who doesn't expect to socialize at work, and that's okay. At least... That should be okay. 5. Please think out of the box. Before having that phrase, we need to deepen in company culture and management structure. Is our management lean? Do we have idea database in our company? Do we award new ideas? If we haven't structured this initiatives yet in our organization, just don't even think of talking the box. As a leader, every word should follow our ideology towards the work. It takes time to build this structure and let people understand what we are talking about, how we desire the organization to look like, and how people in the organization see themselves with the organization. Thanks for watching our video. 